Good morning all. Welcome to Exam Notes 365. Today we are going to discuss about the important current affairs on 25th January 2022. Let's dive in. Voters Day observed on January 25th. In order to encourage more young voters to take part in the political process, Government of India has decided to celebrate January 25th every year as National Voters Day. It has been started from 25th January 2011. to mark election commission's foundation day election commission founded on 25th january 1950 it is established by the constitution of india directly to ensure free and fair elections in the country who is the minister of law and justice kiran rijiju who is chief election commissioner of india sushil chandra who has named as icc umber of the year 2021 marai erasmus south african official marai erasmus named as icc umber of the year for the third time pakistan wicket keeper mohammad rizwan and england's tammy bernard named the icc men's and women's t20 player of the year what is icc The International Cricket Council is the world governing body of cricket. It's headquartered in Dubai, UAE. Who is the chairman of ICC? Greg Barclay. Who is the CEO of ICC? Jeff Aladis. Which company has bagged 160 crore contract from railways for its key electric components? The answer is Hitachi Energy India Limited. it will supply traction transformers to electric locomotive manufacturers the deal is to support the electrification of the country's railway network to enable indian railways achieve 100 percentage electrification by the year of 2023 why it's important railway electrification is a key element in india's drive towards net zero carbon emissions at the recent un climate change conference cop26 India reaffirms its commitment to shifting to electricity for transport and reducing the economy's carbon intensity by 40 percentage by the year of 2030. Who is the Minister of Railways? Ashwini Vaishnav. Who has named Rachel Hehe Flint Trophy for ICC Women Cricketer of the Year 2021? Smriti Mandana from India. Indian opening batter Smriti Mandana was named the ICC Women's Cricketer of the Year for her incredible run of form across all formats in 2021. Sir Garfield Sobers Trophy for ICC Men's Cricketer of the Year goes to Sahin Alfridi from Pakistan. ICC International Cricket Council headquartered in Dubai, UAE. The chairman is Greg Barclay. Who is the CEO of ICC? Jeff Aladis. Who has appointed as the first woman judge of Pakistan's Supreme Court? Justice Aisha Malik. She was appointed as a judge of the Lahore High Court in March 2012. She will now work as a Supreme Court judge until her superannuation in June 2031. Where is the capital of Pakistan? Islamabad. The Prime Minister of Pakistan is Imran Khan. Who is the President of Pakistan? Arif Alvi. And the currency is Pakistani rupee. India and Israel launched a commemorative logo to mark the 30th anniversary of the establishment of diplomatic relations. The logo features the star of David and Ashok Chakra, the two symbols that adorn the national flags of both countries. The specially designed logo also features the numeral 30 depicting the 30th anniversary of bilateral relations. The logo was unveiled virtually at an online event in the presence of Ambassador of Israel to India, Noah Gillen, and Ambassador of India to Israel, Sanjeev Singla. Where is the capital of Israel? 
Jerusalem. Who is the Prime Minister of Israel? Naftali Bennett. And the President is Isaac Herzog. Currency of Israel. Israel Shekel. Next, next question. Who has re-elected as the Prime Minister of Barbados? The answer is Mia Motley. Barbados is an Eastern Caribbean island. On November 30, 2021, Barbados became the world's newest republic. It officially removed Queen Elizabeth II as the head of state around 400 years after it became a British colony. Where is the capital of Barbados? Bridgetown. Who is the president of Barbados? Sandra Mason. And the currency is Barbadian dollar. Fashion designer Manfred Mary Mugla passed away recently. From which country does he hail from? The answer is France. Manfred Mary Mugler, who launched his brand in 1973, became known for his architectural style. His dramatic designs were worn by celebrities like Madonna, Lady Gaga and Cardi B. International Day of Education observed on January 24. The day is celebrated as it marks the importance of education in ensuring peace and development. It was proclaimed in 2018 by United Nations General Assembly. What is the theme of International Day of Education 2022? Changing course, transforming education. Where is the headquarters of UN? New York City. Who is the Secretary General of UN? Antonio Guterres. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please share it with your friends. Also, to get daily current affairs videos, please subscribe to our channel. See you tomorrow. Bye.